Got two brand new Dyson vacuums to test stuff for you. These are the two newest vacuums that they offer. And uh, I'm pretty excited to try these guys out. This one's more made just for hard floors, and this one is made for both. We have the Dyson Omni Glide, and then we have the Dyson V15 Detect, which has a laser that sits up front, as you see here, and it shines down on the floor, showing you any type of little particles that you may have missed whenever you were vacuuming. We're going to be putting that through the test to make sure that it's even a useful feature, or is it just a gimmick? I've always had Dyson's, always been a big fan of them. They're definitely expensive, but you get what you pay for. They last a long time. The suction is outstanding. And you just can't really beat a Dyson. So, which one should we go out and unbox first? D-Y-S-O-N. All right, Omniglide. This thing's pretty cool looking to me. All right, I'm pretty excited to go out and unbox this guy. I think it's gonna do really good on all my tests. Uh, once again, this is more for hard floors. It's not really made at all for carpet because it has dual soft rollers. And what's cool about this, doesn't matter if you're pushing forward, backward, sideways, there's always a roller that's spinning and that will cl clean up the dust for you. So pretty cool technology. I've never seen anything like it. We'll be putting this through a ton of tests, seeing if it's worth the $400 price tag. Let's go ahead and cut into this guy. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have any Dyson vacuums or what your favorite one is. Wow, this thing is smaller than I even thought. Just gonna pull out the main unit real quick. So that is it. Look how tiny that dust bin is. That's probably gonna be a complaint of mine when I get to all the testing. It's just very, very small. But this thing's gonna be also very easy to go and empty when it's full. So. Cool looking unit, typical Dyson. Here is the extension pole. Go ahead and click this into place real quick. Another cool thing about this, it does come with attachments. So this is the crevice tool. And this thing will slide up and help loosen up any dirt like on the stairs or wherever. And this thing is so light and portable, it's gonna be really good for getting around your house and cleaning like stairs and blinds, harder to reach areas. Of course it comes with manuals. Let's see what's in here. All right, here is Hmm. I'm going to be 100% honest. I don't know what this is for yet. It comes with a little pencil and a couple of strips, but I will let you know by the end of this video. Oh, never mind. Duh, I know what this is. So this is to mount it to the wall. This is just like 3M double sided tape. A couple of screws to screw it into the wall and this is just to mark your spot. Never seen a, any company give you a pencil, so that's why I was a little bit confused. Here is the charging station. It's more of a dock. All right, so very cool. You're gonna screw this in your wall or mount it with the 3M tape. So it's gonna be sitting in your wall like this. And then the Dyson will just go up and click on it and stay on the wall while it's charging. So pretty cool. Definitely can appreciate that. And it's so small, it probably looks pretty cool on the wall to be honest. All right, here's the main feature of this vacuum. As you can see, it got rollers on both sides. And no matter which way you're going, forward, backwards, sideways, this thing swivels each and every way. This is going to be probably the easiest vacuum we're ever going to use on hardwood floors. So I'll be putting this through all my tests. We'll see how big of debris this thing can actually suck up. Can it handle things like Fruit Loops or jelly beans, something of that size? But pretty cool.
And that is all that's in this box. And this will click in like so. Very cool. What do you guys think? Are you guys concerned about this little tiny bin? That thing's gonna fill up very quick, especially for the type of test I do. But we'll, we'll test it out. We'll see how it is for everyday cleaning and if this tiny bin is enough. So let's just go in a power down, see how much power this little guy has, and I'll show you how easy it is to maneuver. You can kind of do it any which way. Sideways, front and back. You just twist your arm exactly how you want to do it. It's so easy. And no matter which way you're pushing it, these rollers are going to be in contact with the debris and very easily suck it up. As a matter of fact, let's do a really quick test. There's just some white rice I had sitting right there. It's going to be normal suction. As you can see, you can pull on it, go sideways. And it's effortless. It's very light. Yeah, pretty cool. I think this thing is very cool looking. Like I said, overall it's very light and very powerful. So this is unboxing number one. We're gonna move on to the V15 Detect now. And I'm gonna be reviewing these extensively on this channel. So if you like these Dyson vacuums at all, please do me a huge favor, like this video and subscribe. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing a ton of tests with both of these. I also have a Dyson V10 that I'll be pitting these up against and see which one's truly better. Alright guys, now for the big boy, the Dyson V15 Detect. I picked this up at Best Buy for $699, so not cheap by any means. Hopefully at the end of all my testing I can recommend this guy to you. And we're definitely going to see if that laser is more of a gimmick or if it actually does anything. And uh, I'm pretty excited to try this out. So let's go ahead and get into it. Dyson packaging, got the warranty, the manuals, all that good stuff. Let's see what kind of accessories we get. Alright, we have the crevice tool, which of course comes with pretty much every vacuum cleaner out there. Always comes in handy. We have this one as well, very typical of most vacuums, they extend and makes it a little bit easier to get up to the crumbs and stuff more in the corner. Still a very handy tool. It's nice that it's included. Here's the main tube. It's going to connect to the main body. Dyson V15 Detect. Pretty excited. Why hello there. Alright, also with pretty much all the higher end Dysons, probably about $400 plus on the stick vex. You're going to get a wall mount like this. You can maneuver the charging port through here and then you can attach this to the wall and same as that or similar to that. The whole Dyson will sit down in this and then you can charge it as it's storing it and you can also put your attachments down here. Very cool. All right, here's the main head. Kind of a new thing with this guy is anti-tangle comb. We'll be putting that through the test as well, making sure that this thing truly does good with hair. Very cool. Then you can also adjust the gate for how big your debris is going to be. Definitely been using that as well. And what's very good with this guy is it does in fact come with a soft roller. Which I can definitely appreciate and of course this is the one that has the laser. The normal one, this one here, does not come with the laser. The laser is only used for this one. Because this is typically a hard floor model. Edit. So this is a hard floor head and so this is the only one with the laser. This one's designed more for the carpet so therefore not really a reason to have the laser because it's not going to be able to help you out at all on the carpet whereas this can still see dust on the hardwood. So excited to try this out. I really don't know if it's just going to be a gimmick or if you're truly going to be able to see like wow 
I missed a spot. Let's go over there and clean it. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments if you believe this is really going to work well. Here's a couple more tools. This one's more of a stiff brush to kind of help loosen up any type of dirt that's stuck on carpets. This is really good for your carpets in your car. Definitely going to loosen up all the dirt and do a much better job cleaning. Here is another attachment. This one's really good for stairs. And this one also has the Tango Free technology. So we'll be able to test this guy out too and see how well he does with hair. All right, here's another very common tool that you'll see with a lot of vacuums. Once again, brushes to help loosen up dirt and make your cleaning much easier. Part of the wall mount that whenever you attach to the wall, this is going to be lower. And it's basically going to, going to accept this like so, so that it doesn't damage your walls or anything like that. This is the first Dyson I've got on that has something like this. My V10 did not come with this. The V10 did not come with one of these either. That's why I'm very excited that this includes a soft roller. All right, this should be one of the last pieces. Oh, take that back. Here is the charging cord, basically the same as all Dyson's. And possibly last, there's so much stuff in here. Here is the main unit. It's got a nice big canister on it. This is going to hold a ton of debris. And I'm very excited to try this. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm going to be doing lots of tests with this. I'll be showing you everything. Oh my god, stop it. Edit. <laughs> I'll be showing you everything that this thing offers, all the different settings, and uh, yeah, that's the V15 Detect. What do you guys think? Let me put it together for you real quick, and I'm going to do a quick demonstration on the table again, and we'll see if the laser does anything. Let me go give, grab my uh, V10 for comparison reasons. I didn't expect it to be that much bigger. Here's my V10. Great vacuum. Love it. Works fantastic, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to love this guy even more. As you can see a much bigger tank. This thing's going to be more powerful as well. And yeah, I'm pretty excited. Put this together real quick. Then we'll attach the soft head. See if the laser turns on. I haven't messed with the switch at all, so let's see if it's on from the factory or not. It is? Okay, cool. So it might be a little bit hard to see on this table. I mean, I even work on this table, but I'm just going to pretend I'm cleaning and we'll see, especially on camera, if you guys can see anything. I'll tell you what, <laughs> just from that instant test, I can't see it right now. There's a piece of hair at the end of this table that, I'll try to zoom in when I edit this, that from here I cannot see it, but the laser I could see it. Wow, okay. This thing's going to be fun. I'm actually really excited to test this guy out. Awesome. Hopefully that showed up on video at all. Actually, let me, let me flick off this light. We'll see if that does anything. Turn off this one behind me too. Hopefully this shows on camera. There you go. All right, well that's gonna wrap up these unboxings. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you did, please do me a massive favor, hit that like button, subscribe. I am doing a giveaway on this channel. It is for two robot vacuums. The iRobot Roomba 692 and the 981. I'll put a link down in the description for how to enter. And uh, hopefully you would love to join this channel. I would love to have you. Definitely leave comments. I try to reply to everybody if possible. And uh, thanks again for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Have an awesome day and I will see you in the next video.